Well, even though we don't see them all the time, rats are plaguing hundreds of homes in Kern County. Kern vector control workers say the pests thrive in vegetation. And 23 ABC's Lindsay Adams has some advice on keeping your home rat free. People just don't notice them as much in the winter time because they're inside more. It's cold outside. But the rats are still there, and roof rats are a problem in Bakersfield. Rats tend to gravitate towards older buildings and also like to live in palm trees. Palm trees have a lot of fronds that just get left on there, and it gives them a nice place to live. They like Italian cypress. And they go to the fruit trays for food. Over at the Kern Mosquito and Vector Control, workers are dealing with nearly a thousand active roof rat cases. They like to be in attics because it's warm and it's comfortable. And if, if we're living there, they, they would like it too. Workers say rats can easily get into any small crevice in your attic, and it's important to fill up any openings that you might have. Overlapping roof lines are sealed up, uh, uh, vents, screen vents underneath the eaves. Or, uh, gaps around pipes. You should also make sure to keep your garage door closed, keep vegetation trimmed, and throw away extra clutter and food. If left untreated, rats can cause for some major problems. Chew on wires and potentially burn your house down. They can chew through phone cords. Um, they can chew through PVC piping water lines in your attic. Rats can also carry diseases such as the hantavirus, but workers say this hasn't been an issue with the rats in Kern County. In Bakersfield, Lindsay Adams, 23 ABC.